It is Lucy Greer, and Lucy has a special guest today. Yeah, and he's really <laughs> tall. He is really, really tall, you guys. This is Lucy. And Lucy, I'm going to let you introduce our sous chef for the day. This is Nick, <laughs> our oldest boy. Nick's uh, twin, Jack, came on a few months ago, and I told Nick that it would mm -hmm. be his turn next. So he is ready to see everybody today, right? Yeah, and Nick, <laughs> do you know what we're making today? I didn't run it by you first. Chili, maybe? White chicken chili, which you like all this. You like regular chili, yeah. and you haven't tasted this yet, but I think you're going to like it. All right. Well, this <laughs> is the ultimate test. Lucy, tell us what we're, uh, our ingredients for this white chicken chili. Okay, so we have our pot here, and we're going to add a tablespoon of olive oil, and then I have a large onion that I chopped up, and I'm going to put this in. You know what Jack said the other day? He said, I would really like some sautéed onion for dinner. <laughs> just That's what Jack said. Jack, uh, Jack is a card, isn't he, Nick? Just sautéed onions. Just sautéed onions. He did not get that, but we'll let him know that this is in the recipe. Mm -hmm. um, and then we're going to add our spices in. So we have ground cumin, which that is used a lot of time in chili. We have a little bit of onion powder and some smoked paprika. The smoked paprika is what you and Elle smelled, and what did you think about it? No. You didn't like that. <laughs> Did not like that. Nick, how old are you, buddy? Six. You're six. Now, do you like to play any sports or anything? Yeah. What kind of sports do you play? T-ball. Well, T-ball? Is that so much fun? Does Now, does your brother play with you? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. All right. Well, that sounds like a whole lot of fun. Lucy, real quick before we go, a new ad drop today. Um, and you guys are always super busy at Greer's. We are. We have a new ad, and we're gearing up for Mardi Gras. Mm -hmm. We have King Cakes already out there, and um, we are so excited. You know, we have uh, three stores now downtown. Um, so we have, of course, our store at Government and Broad, and then South Broad Street that we've always had, and we always get excited about Mardi Gras. And now our new store on St. Louis Street. Um, we're just a couple blocks off of the parade route. Fun. Um, so it'll be a fun place to gather before and after parade. So if you haven't had a chance to um, to go down there as you're thinking about Mardi Gras coming up, um, maybe you can stop by and see us at our new store. Awesome. And we are going to continue this white chicken chili with Lucy. Nick, great job, buddy. We'll be back with Nick and Lucy next on Studio 10. Joe. Welcome back into our Studio 10 kitchen. We've got myself and Lucy Greer, but we also have the star of the show today, which is Nick. Nick, good to see you, buddy. Hi. <laughs> Say you too. Say hi. <laughs> hi. What are you doing here? Have you been stirring? Yes, sir. What are we making? Do you remember? White chicken chili. Nice. Good student. White chicken chili. Well, you're doing a great job of stirring it up. So, Lucy, what's the next step in the process? All right. So, right now we have our onions. Nick just added some garlic. We've let these cook for about eight or ten minutes with all of our chili spices. Yeah. And now we are going to add the liquid. So, do you want to stir or do you want to pour? Um, pour. That's more fun. All right. So, we're going to add four. It's already open. So, four cups of chicken broth. You can just pour it in. Whoops. Good. Yeah. All of it. And then nice we're also job. the green chili, so we're gonna add one. Wait, the whole thing. Yeah, the whole thing. <laughs> there we go. Um, and we're gonna add one can of diced green chilies. That's seven ounces. And then I have one can of green enchilada sauce. So this is gonna be all the liquid in our chili. And we want to make it, and so what we're gonna do at this point is um, we'll turn the heat up and bring that up to- Yeah, get it all out. That is right. Get we it all wanna... out. You need every last drop of that yeah. chicken broth for hey, sure. Your godmother, Mary Kyle, she always says, waste not, want not. So <laughs> um, we don't wanna waste any. So, okay, that's good. Yeah, now we okay. need you to start okay. it. <laughs> um, so we're going to bring that up to a simmer and we want to make it a really creamy chicken chili. So we have two cans of white cannellini beans, white kidney beans, or you could use a northern bean, um, whichever bean you like. And we, what did we do with these? We rinsed them off yeah. and we drained them. So you want to add that can. Add that can in there, and then what we're going to do with the other can is we are going to, you can use a blender or a food processor, and I'm going to add this can over here, and we're going to take a little bit of that liquid, and we are going to blend it up and then pour it back in here, so it's going to create a nice, smooth, creamy um, chili for us. So yeah, what a great idea. Here. 
get some of that and then over the break we'll blend it up and add it and then we're going to cook this for 15 minutes and then all we're going to do next is add our finishing touches. Well this is kind of a, a throwback show to our good friend Chastity Bird. I talked to her on the phone for a while yesterday and now she's texting both of us she because is. she recalls uh, when Nick first arrived and also the fact that we gave him this little apron here. Yes, when I was pregnant with the twins, y'all gave Nick and Jack these little aprons and then Elle, she has not come on the show yet, but she'll mm. be next. Nice. So she's already four and she has a pink little apron um, from our friends at Studio 10 and our new baby sister. Um, she hadn't been on either. Tell everybody what her name is. Skittle. Skittle. So maybe <laughs> Skittle can come on too, but she wouldn't sit here and, and do as good as you, would she? What would she be doing? Messing it up. Messing it up. Yeah, <laughs> that she would be messing it up. But she'd eat it, that's for sure. She's a good eater. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, great job, Nick. Uh, you did fantastic. We're going to come back and continue this process right here with the folks from Greer's Markets. Good stuff. Uh, what a fantastic sous chef today, Chelsea. Welcome back to Studio 10. We're back in the kitchen with Lucy and her adorable son, Nick. And we are so excited you are here. Nick, you're going back to school after this, right? Yeah. Hey, I have a question for you. Now, your mom's a chef, and she gets to cook for us every Wednesday. What's your favorite thing that she cooks? Do you have a favorite meal? What do you like that I cook? Meatloaf. 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 <laughs> that is so funny. Nick started out a little bit of a picky eater, but you have gotten a lot better at eating a lot of different foods, haven't you? Yes. All I've right. been impressed. Yes, meatloaf was a shock for sure. Lucy, you're going to have to bring your meatloaf <laughs> recipe now <laughs> no. because I've got to try it for I myself. Will. So when we get home, you'll have to taste this chili because you like regular chili, but today we're making what? What's this? White chicken chili. White chicken chili. That's, That's right. right. So we're we've gotten down to the end, right? So we added, um, we sauteed our onions and garlic, and then we added um, chicken broth. And yeah, you can add, add that in. We added chicken broth and green enchilada sauce, and some green chilies, and then. We added, <laughs> here, let me help you. Yeah. You're right. Get in there, he Get said. In there. Come on, corn. <laughs> and then we let that simmer, and remember we added some beans, too. So we added, yeah, that's going to get sticky on your hands. So uh -oh. That was one cup of corn. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> let me put this in for you. This is cream cheese. So that was one cup of frozen corn. Mm -hmm. That Here, stir that up first, please. And then this is half. Uh -oh of uh, yep yeah, this is going to take a little bit so it's best if you do this four ounces of cream cheese if you can get it to room temp um, it takes a little bit to get that melted in there but it will melt mm -hmm. um, and then the last thing that we're going to add the chicken part i just got a rotisserie chicken and I just shredded that up. So um, if you didn't want to do that, of course, you could cook white or dark meat chicken. This is just a couple cups. Um, so once we get all that cream cheese melted, then we will add in our chicken and we'll be ready to go. So it didn't take a ton of ingredients. Mm -hmm. It was a very cost effective to make this. And um, the good thing about this too is that you can kind of adjust the heat level. I used um, some chipotle chili powder in there. Um, so you could go up or down on that depending Perfect. on your heat level. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> Go to seven. Yes, All right. The numbers on there. Well, we are going to finish this up with them and we are so thankful for this recipe. It's going to be on our website. Nick, good job, buddy. We are so, so excited you. to have you today on Studio 10. Joe, I bet he's a better cook than you. <laughs> 